Let's start with JavaScript with the simplest possible code we can run, an operation between two values. I already described the beginning of our coding process with the loading of the starter code HTML file into the browser. At that point, the JavaScript environment becomes available to us to run. Let's see the simplest way that we can interact with this environment. Once I've loaded the starter code files into the browser, then I can right click and go to inspect. This is going to open up the Chrome DevTools console, and I can click on the console tab at the top. This environment allows me to interact with the JavaScript on this page. So I can type in some numbers, and when I hit enter, this is a valid JavaScript statement that I am executing. So let's take a look at some of the simple operations we can do between these kinds of data. JavaScript statements and code that we write are instructions to the computer to do something. And the simplest instructions we can give the computer is to do some math calculations. So if I type in a math calculation here, then I will see JavaScript compute the result. So 2 plus 2 is 4. 2 minus 2 is 0. 3 times 3 is 9. 9 divided by 3 is 3. I'm not limited by the number of operations that I do in a single statement. So I can add together several different numbers. And I can do different operations between different numbers. And I can group numbers, operations of numbers together uh, using parentheses. If I want to clear away what I've done so far, I can hit the clear button up here and uh, it clears away everything.